Cowboys 49ers, a matchup that represents a time that gave us maybe the greatest rivalry the NFL's ever seen. And I know that's saying a lot, but think about everything those matchups had. But that time also represents more. Since those three straight conference championship games following the 1992, 93, and 94 seasons, Dallas has been back there just once the following year when they went on to win Super Bowl 30. San Francisco, by contrast, has been back to the NFC Championship five times. They've made two Super Bowls during that span, played in one just two years ago. But you know who else has been in the NFC Championship game since January of 96? The Packers, the Panthers, the Falcons, the Vikings, the Rams, the Buccaneers, the Giants, the Eagles, the Seahawks, the Bears, the Saints, the Cardinals. All of them at least twice. When you expand the list to include all NFL teams that have made a conference title game since 1995, Steelers, Colts, Patriots, Jaguars, Broncos, Jets, Titans, Ravens, Raiders, Chargers, Chiefs, Bills. All of them except for Buffalo at least twice. Meaning a Cowboys franchise that along with the Packers, Steelers, Raiders, 49ers, and Patriots is among the most storied in the NFL is more like the Texans, Lions, and Bengals over the league's last quarter century. Washington, the Browns, and Dolphins round out the list of teams that haven't made a conference championship game since the mid-90s. Nothing wrong with enjoying the nostalgia that Dallas-San Francisco conjures. I've been enjoying the heck out of it all week long. It's just that you come back to the realization that right now, that's what the Cowboys' best days are. History.